Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the third. Okay, keep in mind the timing is fluid, so if I get the date wrong, whatever. Um, yeah, so let's just see what comes up. I just cut the deck. I got the Ace of Wands upright and the uh, Eight of Swords reversed. So the Eight of Swords reversed is removing restrict restrictions. An obstacle is being removed. Somebody may have removed themselves from a situation that was restricting them. You know, it's like the restrictions being lifted. This is a new direction. This is exciting. Okay. Um, taking action. So there's somebody here that is taking action to remove themselves from a situation. It's Or the restrictions are being removed. An obstacle is being removed. Um, somebody was playing it safe, but now this is ready. This is, I'm ready. I'm ready. So uh, aces are new beginning. So we have a new passionate beginning here. An obstacle. Maybe the obstacle was fear. I don't know. Queen of Wands reversed. So, Queen of Wands reversed could be Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Um, whew. Queen of Wands reversed. I mean, I need to get some more cards, but my intuition says that this is a lack of passion, a lack of growth, low confidence, low self confidence. Um, angry, angry. Somebody may be angry upset there could also be another woman that has been causing problems or there's they, somebody may have severed ties with another woman when the queen of wands comes up in a in a reading it could be that there's another person involved another woman could even be another man um but there's some sort of anger here um let me get some another card to go with that hangman Hangman reverse. We could be dealing with Pisces. We dealing with Pisces and a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Anyhow, hangman reverse. That is struggling to let go. Will not change. There is somebody here that will not change. They are unwilling to budge. This is somebody that is probably hiding something that is very egotistical, that is unwilling to go within. This person is unwilling to change their mind. This is this is like very, very stubborn, extremely stubborn. Will not look at things from anybody else's perspective. Un very, we may have somebody here that is very self-centered, that is entitled you know this person is entitled they are unwilling to budge in any way this is like uh also strong control very controlling un unwilling to relinquish control angry upset eight of pentacles underneath King of Pentacles reversed. Tower. Tower reversed. Unavoidable change. Somebody's been in a false sense of security. They've been trying to avoid upheaval. It's necessary. Okay, a, ne a change is necessary. But we have somebody here that has put in a lot of effort. They've put in a lot of effort to a false sense of security and letting go of it may be embarrassing. It may be, you know, publicly embarrassing to let go of it. <clears throat> There's greed here with the King of Pentacles. There's greedy. There's selfish, materialistic. We may even have somebody here that is doing something illegal you know there's illegal dealings here 
doing something unfaithful. You know, we, we may even have unfaithful, disloyal behavior here as well. Somebody may be doing something. They're hiding it. They're doing it while they're at work. Maybe maybe they're they're ha they're they're some they're having relations with somebody while they're at work. They say they're at work or something like that. But the tower is like the whole thing falling apart. The truth. I feel like there's some truth that cannot be avoided. I feel like there is something that is a there's some light that is going to be shed. This foundation is crumbling. Okay, it's a painful change. Somebody's probably going to be moving. I'm not sure if they're getting caught. They could be getting thrown out suddenly. We could have a say. Say this is what's happening. We could have another woman here who loses her shit. She can't control herself, and she's, you know, just tells all. There's gonna be upheaval, and it is unavoidable. It's not avoidable. It's not. Somebody's going to be losing their stability. They're going to be losing their stability. They're going to be losing their foundation or something like that. And it's because they're unwilling to change. This is somebody that is entitled. It's like, I'm entitled. That needs constant attention. This is somebody that... Um, likes control. And they're about to lose it. Okay, They're about to lose their control. And they're going to get angry. They're going to get very, very angry. And I feel like they're getting angry because there's something that is being revealed. That's what I see with this tower. It's like, wow. I just want to say, wow. And maybe those words come, wow, wow, wow. I can't believe that you did this. That kind of thing. Um, we have a very cunning, clever individual here who has been lying. The Eight of Swords is about lies. It really is. And so I feel like there's some sort of exposure of them lies. There's some sort of heartbreak here. This is heartbreaking. It's a heartbreaking separation or a loss or something like that. This is like a painful separation. Again, with the uh, tower card, that's a painful change that you never saw coming. It's a rude awakening. Somebody's about to get a rude awakening. This is like a loss. It could be a fight. It could be extreme with the tower. This is something you never saw coming. Extreme upheaval. We have an individual here that has been working hard to hide something. I feel like they've been hiding something. This person may even have some anger issues. You know, maybe they've hidden their anger issues up until now. If they did, they aren't. There's, there's going to be an outburst. There could absolutely be an angry outburst ahead. There's instability. It's like losing the shit. Somebody's about to lose their shit. I think it's over another person. I do. I think it's over another person. Somebody may have been unfaithful. It doesn't, I mean, it doesn't have to be unfaithful. There's definitely falseness here. There's lies. That Eight of Swords is lies. And I, and I cut it to that. And hiding something with the hangman reverse. This is somebody, and extremely cunning. Extremely cunning. Knight of Pentacles, Six of Pentacles, Queen of Cups reversed. So, Knight of Pentacles is a hard work or something about work, something about doing something while at work. Again with the Six of Pentacles, falseness, lies, deception. Somebody's doing something while they're at work and they're going to, I don't know if they're stealing or what they're doing, it's something illegal. They're going to get caught and it doesn't have to be theft. There may be, a, I feel like there's another woman involved. I feel like it's a woman. I mean, it could be a man, but I really feel like it's a woman. Um, Queen of Cups reverse, very emotional, sad, disappointed, disappointed, disappointed with this, what's happening. Somebody's been giving to somebody at work. 
giving maybe giving their attention or if it's not work they've been building uh, maybe they've been slowly building a foundation with somebody else behind the scenes There's going to be an, emo an emotional outburst ahead. Cannot master emotions. Trust me, there is. Somebody hasn't been practical. They may, And there could be even fighting over money. Okay, this may be fighting over money. Okay, I do feel like there's another woman involved though. Maybe somebody's hiding another woman and they're only staying in a foundation just for the woman, for the money and they get caught. I don't know. There's, I do believe there's fighting. I think there's fighting over money There's or there's fighting over something being revealed. This is disappointing. It is definitely an emotional disappointment. Maybe there's been a change in a foundation that was unpredictable and that causes a fight. There's going to be a fight. I know that there is. It's like being taken, it's like the, something is being taken from somebody and, and given to somebody else. I do feel like we have an individual that has been trying really, really hard to make a false sense of security work. That They've been hiding something. They've been hiding it really, really well. And I feel like, I feel like things are just going to fall apart. Something's going to be revealed that blows up this false sense of security. This is going to be a blow up, okay? Somebody's about to get exactly what they deserve, okay? I mean, with the Six of Pentacles, that's about getting what you deserve. You reap what you sow. There's good, I feel like there's going to be a loss. Somebody, and it's like, I feel like there could be a rejection or there could be some tears that are shed. Okay, somebody may be deciding to go someplace else i mean that tower reverse that's like packing up it's like rebuilding someplace else um seven of pentacles reverse dead end dead end this is unrealistic this is not practical it's dissatisfying somebody has been trying to make a, that dead tree grow right they've been trying to make something grow that is already dead I do feel like there's going to be a relocation here. Somebody may be receiving an offer that does bring them relocation. There could be somebody here that is getting a solid opportunity to relocate. You know, and it's heartbreaking to the other person that they, you know, were in a false sense of security with because they didn't want to be alone or whatever the reason was. I do think there is a rejection here. It's going to be a shock. It's going to be a surprise. Somebody's gotten or they have received another opportunity that is more solid, that is more aligned. Okay. Somebody has received another opportunity. And I feel like they're, they're going to be planting their seeds or they have been already planting their seeds someplace else. It's time to go. We also have somebody here that is lying a lot. This person is very malicious. They're lying. They, they've been uh, not telling the truth, maybe even delusional. I knew it. Unexpected choice in love. I knew it. This is like a soulmate connection. It's a, there's a deep attraction here. It's, it's, it's like it's meant to be. This is a, a, ch a choice between two lovers. It's a choice between two options, right? These are two people that ha have shared values, you know, that have a lot in common, that have a deep uh, connection with each other. And I feel like there's been... Somebody has been unable to fully invest. There is definitely two women here. 
because they were in a false sense of security with one, but that false sense of security is crumbling. I feel like, I feel like there's, this is like complete chaos. It is. Somebody is making a choice. They, they may be relocating very suddenly. It could be extremely suddenly. You never saw it coming. It just happens. It's like, no, I got to go after what I deserve. You know, I want balance. I want, I want reciprocation. I, I want something solid, real, stable, secure. You know, I do feel like we have an individual that is angry. They have been stuck. They've been stuck. They've been stuck in a false sense of security, the false foundation. They've been stuck there because they weren't being practical. They weren't being realistic. They weren't grounded. It was financially stable. But there was no love there because there's no love right until we get down to the lover's card. And all these cards, there's no love there. There's no love until we get to the, the perfect match down here. Okay, so I do believe that somebody has been investing you know, in this dead end for quite some time. And I think it's all coming to an end. It's all coming to a halt. It's all crashing down. It's crashing hard. It's a hard crash. And I feel it's because th this person has been brought together with a perfect match. I mean, the lovers is a perfect match, you know. And the Knight of uh, Pentacles is about acting with integrity. It's about being real. I do feel like we have a real solid opportunity that is, uh, somebody is deciding to, the Ace of Wands, it's like a new sexual partner, right? It's a new exciting adventure. Somebody has a new exciting opportunity for stability, for security, for reciprocation, for alignment, you know, with these sixes to have peace and harmony in their life with a partner that, they have some sort of deep attraction to, you know, there's some sort of, I feel like there's a, I gotta be honest with you, the, the lovers is a sexual attraction and so isn't the ace of wands. There's a strong desire to be with this person, but it's, so, it's such a surprise because it's like looking up at the, are you sure? Why did you bring this to me at this time when I was already in a such situation, when I was already had a foundation? Why did you bring this to me? Because that was false. It was built on lies. It was, it was built on fantasy. It was built on illusion. You know, it wasn't, it wasn't what you were, it wasn't your wish fulfillment, you know, so we're bringing you your wish fulfillment. So somebody has definitely been and a false sense of security with somebody that probably, obviously with the Queen of Cups reverse doesn't really love them. You know, it's not, it's an unrequited love situation. So when you stay in a false sense of security where there isn't any love, that's false, okay? You're not, you weren't put on this earth, okay? You weren't put on this earth to be rich. You really weren't. You were put on this earth to love unconditionally. And when the universe, which is the tower card, sees that you're not being loved, you know, they're going to cause upheaval in your life. Or when you're not loving, you know, either way, you know, you were put on this earth to love, not to have all those things. That's why the king of pentacles is reversed. It's not about the materialism, okay? It's not about all those materialistic things. Somebody has been in a false sense of security for all those materialistic things, for the roof, for the, for the money, for the stability, for something, you know, something to hold on to. But if there's no love and there hasn't been, you know, then that's false, okay? That's not what you were put here for. And that can even be for a job. You don't love your job? Okay, then. It could be for your job. Okay, this is about love with the lover's card. It's about love. It's about companionship. It's about happiness. It's about uh, partnership. It's about union. It's about uh, connection. It's about feelings, okay? It's about being together with somebody who's going to reciprocate and... Uh, invest in you in the same way that you invest in them. So, get prepared for a change. I don't think you can prepare for it. I think some of you have already met this other person with a lover's card. That's an unexpected choice in love. 
but you will have to maybe pack up and leave with the seven of pentacles reverse this is like plant your seeds go someplace else relocate i do see relocate here somebody has received i feel like they've already received the stable offer but they've been letting their feelings get the best of them and probably something to do with embarrassment. I'm, you know, what's everybody going to say if I follow my heart, if I make this judgment call to leave this false sense of security? They're all going to say I'm crazy, you know, or they're going to look down on me. That's lack of self-confidence, okay? And there's lack of self-worth here as well with the King of Pentacles reverse. We got fear, okay? We got fear, we got lack of self-confidence, we got cowardly behavior, we have um, insecure, you know, you need to know your value. We got somebody here that doesn't know their value. They're staying in this false sense of security because they're disillusioned and they don't know their value and they've been trying to build up this cracked foundation is they've been trying to build up this impression that everything is good when it's not it's really 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 not and it's emotionally draining anyhow i do believe that we have somebody here that is uh there's going to be an emotional or angry or both emotionally, emotional, angry outburst ahead because it's like, I can't take it anymore. I can't take it anymore. It's like a big blow up. This is clinging to control. The wheel. It's unfortunate. This is an unfortunate loss, but it's not meant to be. Somebody has their foot in the wheel. The wheel's trying to spin them towards their reward, towards their fortune, but they got their foot in the wheel. It's like you've already met, you've already met this soulmate, but you're not going in that direction. You got your foot in the wheel because you're so stubborn. You don't, you don't want the reward. You don't want the abundance. So there's going to continue to be chaos and upheaval and emotional upsets and losses of money and opportunities are going to be given to somebody else because you won't honor your truth. You won't be open to change. You're unwilling to change. You're so stubborn. So you're going to lose an opportunity. Maybe we got somebody here that's not ready. They're not ready for their new life, right? They want to stay in the false sense of security because of their own insecure, their own insecurities. It's like, I'm so insecure with myself. I'm so afraid. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. This is a horrendous loss. It is a horrendous loss. This is, somebody is needing to go in a new direction. This is bad luck. This is a setback. This is no, nothing fortunate will come if you are not willing to change. They hang me in reverse, unwilling to change. Have you heard of evolution? Everything changes. I do believe somebody is going to be packing up. They're going to be packing up with the seven of pentacles reverse and the tower reverse this is unavoidable change you can't avoid it you can't oh yes i can oh no you can't you you, you your whole shit's gonna crumble around you until you accept the truth until you take action we got somebody here who hasn't taken any action queen of wands reverse you know that's somebody who isn't taking any action doesn't matter what sign you are this person is trying to build up this false sense of security so it looks so great but on the inside it is a fucking mess everybody sees it trust me they do
You got to break free. Now it's on the bottom, upright. Break free from that mental turmoil. Step out of your comfort zone. You want to be tied to this situation? Yeah, is it really that comfortable? Is it really that comfortable? Is it? You have the means to escape. We have somebody here that is in a situation that they can escape from, but they have let their fear get in the way. Set yourself free. Unless you want to live in prison. You want to be in the mental prison. You want to stay in this prison. You want to continue to feel all this mental turn, turmoil and lack. Next card is the Nine of Swords. It only gets worse. If you don't step out of the situation now, it's going to get worse. Nine of Swords, Ten of Swords. Is that what you want? You want to be brought to your knees? You want to get betrayed even more? You want to get stabbed in the back? You want to get hurt more? You want to have more depression? You want to not be able to get out of bed in the morning? You want things to get worse? Remove yourself from the situation before it's too late. Before it gets worse. You have an opportunity right now. Good luck. 